using a speed camera at the front of the vehicle. The active emergency braking system determines the distance between you and the vehicle in the same lane ahead of you, or approaching a crossroads from the opposite direction, and warns you if there is a risk of collision. The system can also take control and apply the brake for you to avoid or limit damage from a potential collision. Remember, the active emergency braking system detects traveling vehicles ahead of you when you are driving at between 4 and 105 miles per hour. Conversely, stationary vehicles are detected when you are driving at between 4 and 50 miles per hour. Lastly, when you're at a crossroads, vehicles traveling in the opposite direction at between 19 and 34 miles per hour are detected when you are driving at between 4 and 15 miles per hour and you have your direction indicator on. If a risk of collision is detected, this red indicator lights up on the instrument panel, accompanied by a beep. If you brake, and the system detects that the risk of collision is still present, the braking force will be increased by the system. If you do not brake, or do not take evasive action despite the audible and visible warning, Active emergency braking is triggered and the vehicle brakes, coming to a complete halt if necessary. If the danger is imminent, the audible warning, an emergency braking may occur simultaneously. In the case of a complete halt, the system ceases to apply the brakes. You must apply the brake pedal to keep the vehicle stationary. You can of course interrupt braking at any time by quickly pressing the accelerator pedal, or turning the steering wheel as in an evasive maneuver. To ensure your safety, the active emergency braking system is automatically activated every time the vehicle is started. If you want to deactivate the system though, select the vehicle settings menu on your multimedia screen, then drive assist, active braking, then choose on or off. If your vehicle is not equipped with a multimedia screen, first bring your vehicle to a complete stop, then press this switch to access the vehicle menu. Press the control repeatedly up or down to navigate to the settings menu, then OK to confirm, then select driving assist. Press OK to confirm. Do the same to get to the active braking function and confirm again. Press OK one more time to activate or deactivate the feature. This orange indicator lights up on the instrument panel when the system is deactivated. Be sure to maintain and clean the speed camera so that the active emergency braking system works properly. Bear in mind that the system doesn't respond as efficiently on bends or with smaller road users traffic such as motorbikes or bicycles. Lastly, remember that in certain conditions, such as bad weather, for example snow, hail or black ice, the active emergency braking system may be temporarily impaired. If that happens, this orange indicator appears on the instrument panel. If this indicator light comes on as well, the active emergency braking system has detected a fault. Contact a dealership to fix the problem. It must be emphasized that this feature is an additional driving aid and must not replace your vigilance as a driver. Always pay attention to your driving surroundings.